Hello and welcome back everyone, and Wolf with more Star Wars The Old Republic, playing as Valakar the Bounty Hunter here, once again on the Alliance Camp Headquarters, assisting, obviously, our building alliance, dealing with the Star Fortresses around some of the worlds within the Core Worlds, and basically, anywhere that's not in the Eternal Empire. I know that's a terrible start to an introduction video. Well, just to a video in particular. I'm getting a little bit tired, I'll openly admit to it. And after the solo flashpoint there, whew, I'm a little bit drained. Obviously, we learned a bit about the starports, or the one particularly surrounding Alderaan and how they're powered. And also we know they are shielded by a bunker on the planets they are orbiting. With that in mind, obviously to continue the story arc, we need to go meet with a resistance fighter on the planet, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to go down to Alderaan because we might as well do the one where we actually assaulted the Star Fortress and see if he can help us. I'll see whether or not we'll do the other star, star Fortresses, whether or not they're different. And whether or not the other Resistance members will be available later on is another matter, but... They may give us boosts to our... Alliance's influence. Completing this mission will give us an item to hand over to each Alliance Specialist. Improving their influence by, I think it's 560 or so? No, I think it's just 500. Which is a little boost, a little bonus, not a great deal. But every little helps at this point in the game. After this video as well, I'm going to go look at the actual Sator website and see if chapter 10 and 11 are meant to have been released. Because obviously chapter 10 at the moment is still saying coming soon. But I'm sure 10 and 11 were meant to have been released. So, we'll have to wait and see. Anyhow, we need to speak to you. Chosen a robot. Twelve years. You missed a lot more than I did. <laughs> How is that going to turn the noble houses against each other? I've heard about the shield generator. Scout the field generator's location and test its vulnerabilities. Thank you. Scan for heat signatures. 
Press the wrong button again. Oh, okay, so we got now one of each item already. Good. Level 64. Resolve armoring warding mods. I think we've already equipped them. We bought some for the common data crystals, but it's good that we know we can get them. Okay, where's the shield bunker then? Oh, it's not too far actually. I'm stuck. Thank you. Oh, bloody hell. Take three. Bloody hell. There you go. This is what I get for trying to take a shortcut. Loud. Oh, I can't use this command for another 105 seconds. Oh, well, this is embarrassing. Let's just, um, let's hang around here then for a little while. Okay, I should really stop messing around, shouldn't I? I'm not moving! I'm stuck! So only three more seconds. Oh well, we get to sit around and do nothing. Actually, tell you what. We have all these companions. Let's get them doing something. useful. Thank you. 38 more seconds. Yeah, this is embarrassing. Let's not take a shortcut anymore. <laughs> oh dear. This is what I get for playing this while I'm tired. We'll make this the last video of this session. Give me a countdown now, how kind of it. Why is that over here now? That's a bit awkward. Thank you. Uh, hi? Somehow this has come loose of... There you go. I was going to say, somehow become loose of the tab. Okay. Didn't realise actually you could do that. Remember what I said about not taking a shortcut? Okay, I lied. So here in Alderaan we've been de-leveled to level 34. Right. So standing here. Oh. Shield bunker. We're going to be summoning a walker. Yes, we are.
actually those other alerts are available as well. Let's see if they are still available once we've completed this side mission. If they are, they may give us more of these influence items just by turning up and talking to them. Uh, doesn't tell us the rewards, but something to consider. <laughs> Time to finish the job and destroy the shield generator then. So we can select one reward. In that case, let's have a look. Who needs a most right now? Probably the Amaral. Turn in supply crates to Choza. Okay, where do we gather said supply crates? Crates. Is it someone contacting me? No. Sound like a whisper. Okay, let's have a look at our... Gearing up. That's all we're looking for. Turn in a line supply group. Reach level 10 with Chosa to prepare for an assault on the shield bunker. Level 10 influence! A lot, that's a lot of people. I wonder if that's all going to be the same then. Where do you get the supply crates then? Help factions on the planet resolve their conflicts. What's with the get up? You raid the captain's footlocker or something? My footlocker now. Field promotion. They found his body this morning. Word is he was taken out by a sniper from House Wrist. Assassination. I hear they never missed their marks. Guess the captain was one of them. Rest of us will be too if you both don't get back to patrol. That's an order. Okay then. Helping the local factions. Kinda of confusing how we're meant to do that in this situation. I wonder if there's just missions around, lying around. Let's have a drive around, we'll have a look. Should probably check out the outposts more than anything. I think Chosa was talking about the major houses as well. I don't think House Alt like us, whereas I think they like the, the Alliance. Because obviously House Alt's just to the north here. Can we pop in and say hello or are they going to try and kill us? Nope, they would try to kill us. Hmm.
actually, we're gonna go anywhere. Let's go up to um, House Fool. I've got you. So any factions need a hand, it's gonna be House Fool and House Organa. See any quests that have popped up or that are available? Seems to be, I don't mind it not holding our hand, but it seems to be a little lax on information still. Which doesn't help. Yeah, uh, let's help. travel back to Chosen, have a word with him, just to see what he has to say. Well, we do have five of them, actually. Okay. I didn't realize these were supply crates. I didn't realize these counted. We have two of these. And last one. We're finally ready. Go to the shield generator, breach its outer walls, and I will find you inside. We've gained 10,000 influence. We've chosen. We've geared him up. So we have. Call in an orbital strike against the blaster cans defending the shield bunker. Task complete. Thank you, Scorpio. Or AKA Alternate Showdown. Take a breath. Looks like someone's beat us to it. You can do this as a heroic as well, as you saw. There was an option to switch it to a heroic mission. Okay, now he's um, in my party instead.
Bunker Commander. He can't be incapacitated, but he can be interrupted. Go. According to results in the final, it's bloody hell. Indeed. This one again. Game six, 65. Influence with Chosa once again. Start Hirook. 2 plus flashpoint to Star Fortress. Hmm. That's the Alderaan Star Fortress. Let's get back to. You. Outstanding, Commander. I'll see it put to good use. Understood. There you go. Everyone's uh, level 4 now, or rank 4. If they weren't already. Oh. oh, of course we have some rewards for turning all those items in. So, obviously we can now do the older on destroying the Star Fortress. Force Enclave rank 4. And Alliance Military rank 4. Slowly getting some Radiant Data Crystals. See what these rewards are. Remnant Yavin Warrior's Helm. Little companion gifts, which we can use to improve our influence with some of our characters at least. Trying to decide which way we should go now. Obviously we can do the Alderaan destroying the Star Fortress, but we probably need 
to do the other resistances on your planets than to do the other star fortresses. If we complete this mission, we can select one reward once again. Okay. Hmm. What I'm going to do is I'm going to break this video here and now. Obviously, we'll get ourselves comfortable again. Might as well do this as well. There you go. Yeah, we'll break this video here. I may personally off not recording do the other resistance missions. And then basically we have a choice of which star fortress we want to take on in terms of a flashpoint, a heroic plus two flashpoint. Because obviously people will be asking if we have a look here. Probably asking. Yeah, if we want to do the her console killer last boss. Okay. I wonder if Zyzora would be interested in doing it with us. Tell you what, I'll break this video, I'll whisper him or her, and yeah, we'll see how it goes. This of course is Anforth, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye now.